Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler. And Mrs. Rambler. And we're back to Craft the World, and you've got your broadcast voice with you this time? I do. <laughs> anyway, uh, before we get started, I've got an announcement to make. I have been given several Steam Game Keys that I need to give away. And uh, actually, different sources I've, I've gotten them from. One of them was from the developer of the game Seven Days to Die, who's asked if I would like a copy to give away to my subscribers. So I've also got uh, a subscriber that has given me a whole pile of Steam keys from a variety of different games to give away. So in the coming days and weeks, I'll be thinking of different ways to do it, and, and I'll be making uh, all different announcements. What are you doing? That's not me. Someone's got a control of my mouse. Uh, different announcements of how I'm going to be doing that. So do stay tuned and and uh, we'll have some fun with these. Anyway, I'm going to take back control of, of the uh, steering wheel here. There we go. Where are we and what are we doing? We have our other tower we need to come up with a use for. We've got 28 minutes till the next attack comes in. We're in, right at midnight. Did we finish pretty much all the monsters we're getting there that's what's coming okay you're out here all by yourself so are you oh because we just set this cage over here i'm pretty sure that these guys can handle this let's stay focused on this cage maybe we'll get to see that sheep walk into it um and that noise is because we got near this and suddenly it goes from sweet little crickets to ominous ghosts we still have that to deal with no, he's not in the cage. He just looks like that. <laughs> and these guys are on their way. I just kind of want to see what is happening here. He's walking underwater because they can do that. And there's a chicken down there. Oh, interesting. How do you think our potions got down there from yes. here? Someone must have been carrying it and... Dropped it. Oh, that works. Mm -hmm. They were carrying it, and then they went to attack a goblin, and they threw it down. Mm -hmm. Okay, that works. All right, so let's fire this up and see what happens. He just went home, and he's just going to eat dandelions and completely ignore that we're expecting him to turn around and go this way. All right. So they took care of those skeletons pick enough loot. They're trying to find some the easiest way home. Um, actually, we're not far from level 12. Let's go ahead and use the uh, the mana. They'll run through this one, though only one is going to get through there, and they're going to have to come back to here. Let's leave this running for a while. We'll put three of them in there. Take him out. Take all of these out. Did I blow any traps? No. So we'll take actually the top half. I'll make sure I don't hit traps. That'll work. Top half, take out him, and like that. All right, that works pretty good. So that's that side, Mr. Sheep. Nope, nope, maybe by the end of the episode. Otherwise, we put in... What was that I just saw? He's down here. What is he up to? There's Fido. <laughs> what, is he, what is he thinking? What is he seeing out over here? Hmm. And what was the sheep noise? I've heard that before. There isn't a sheep down in here, right? I've noticed sometimes that the sounds from up above will transmit down randomly. But I could have swore that there was a sheep that had found its way down. What are you? Hunter's book. Taking out. We need to get a lot more. Hello. Yeah, that's that's a, that's a negative there. Okay. But this will be... Actually, we're going to go into... No, that's a new one. We haven't found this one yet. I was thought we were over here. Well, it's the same one. Is here. It? Or over here. So we got one over here. We have one over here. One over here. And one up there. There's four of these so far. And who's knocking on our door? Oh, hitting the traps and trying to... Oh, he's... No, no, no. You do not get to destroy my scaffolding. I don't think so. And got to looking at what I was doing last time. I wanted to put the bridge in lower. So I think we'll put another one in. Just to, I want to know if the archers can come out, walk across the top, and shoot the enemies as they're coming in. Or will they never actually get there and they're just going to go down the ladder anyway. But that's to me, would be a, a nice de defense system. And I also want to know if the tree will stop growing 
at the height of the bridge, or will it go through the bridge? Any idea? I don't know. Take you out. So let's take you out one more time, and let's well eventually find out. Bridge is where. So it depends on how much wood we've got. Well, we can make 18 of them. Yeah, let's do it. Need more lumber. We can make 74. We've been collecting some wood. Good. We get about 20 some lumber stacked up there. So what needs to be done that we have talked about but haven't done? A hatch right here was talked about. But he needs... Well, this needs to move. I think the ladder can go there and they can jump over this and get on the ladder, right? We can build underneath the ladder and it'll still function. Change your door over there. Change my... I thought I did that. I have a memory of doing that. Door. Drop you in there. Click on that and do that. Alright. And that trap just reminded me. Nope, not there yet. Are we going to, or are we going to stop with the last standing line and turn around? What do you want to bet? No, 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 you just hold off. Yep, 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 yep. This maybe has to go in the grass. Maybe that would help. Which means, still have, we kind of still have. Let's do two more of those, take that out. Now, the last two attacks caught me off guard. Let's get some more traps and spikes and cages and all of that all ready to go. So let's build 20 of those cages. Let's grab... Well, what's, what am I doing here? There. Something like that. Boy, I got quiet. <laughs> There, so five, well, well, three more, okay, so eight, and spikes. All right, so with that, let's set this stuff up. Cages, let's get the cages in, well, how do you want to do this? Ca cages first catch them before they hit the traps, which means you get a chance at... at Slowing down the ones that I can catch. And Fil also kill, them giving out. them a chance to do the killing. Do the, the I assume they get experience points for yeah, then you also if they're a warrior. Filter out those people, and then the ones who can go through. Okay, so the the I want to call the them ghouls. Ones. The what are they called? Zombies. The zombies, the zombies will stop and in the cages. Yeah. The skeletons will not, so they will then catch the traps. Yeah. And anything that makes it through the traps will then have to contend with the spikes. That yeah, sound that's like a plan? Good. Okay, I'm just making this up as I go. And he's still sitting there, and I'm going to ignore well, you him. Caught some. We caught a chicken. All right, so let's. We got loot to pick up over here anyway. Let's set this and say that we want to catch the chicken. They're going to come over here and grab them, take them back to our our farm. Yeah. I was thinking we set that up, but yeah, we did. Mm -hmm. And my chair is stuck in a, a hole, and it won't roll. Never mind. I'm, I'm stalling. They should have walked over here by now. Come on, guys. There you go. And you bagged up the chicken, and off you go. And you're appearing here. And on down to the farm. There's Mr. Chicken. Just taking your time. They grunt when you have to walk a long way. Yeah, they like Fly elevators. Or, or separations. Oh, you're saying... It's a little rest, you know, between floors. Okay. So... That's why I usually... We should them. have... Well, I hadn't intended on that, and then it just kind of didn't happen. <laughs> We'll have a lot of grunting then. A lot of grunting. Okay. How is this one? Okay. That one we need to put back. That's second page, right? No, it hasn't made it yet. Um, well, you have to go catch it. I mean, you have to click on it to, to move it. Is that what you want to Yeah, I already, I already took it away. Oh, you did? And I want to put it back in the grass. Oh. Where'd the sheep go? Oh, we're over here. Yeah, we want to put it right here in the, in oh, the grass. See, they have to... It's already... Where? It's sitting there waiting to be picked up. 
Oh, the the uh, uh, the portal ran out. Okay, that was not a good. S All right, he's he's getting out of there. He's being uh, he's she has uh, low health, so is going to go to bed. So and this just no, it didn't. Okay, I was going to say it just died, but it didn't. All right, someone else is going to go take care of that. He dropped all of his goods That's another reason to go why and do I that. Stagger my stairs. Yep, stagger the stairs, and they only fall a little distance. So how do we? No, no. Oh, she just went to bed. Right? No. Got attacked again, or we just got the warning again? Still working it. But why did we get that message? Because she's very. Like there was a change. <laughs> We're having a hard time with this. Put some uh, scaffolding in there. Scaffolding. Give them, uh, help. That's the difference between someone that plays this every night and someone who hasn't turned this on for 18 months and is trying to trying to make this work. Okay, so we got this under control now. All right. So I'm back to thinking about stairs, about our ladders. So if we were to, it doesn't look like there's much to mine out of here, so we might just ignore this area. If we were to... Let's see if it's just one over. Okay. So there... To here. And... Hmm, no matter what I want to do, I hit obstacles. We're out of ladders now. All right, there's a pile of those, and get these out, then we will break this one and stagger this over. And eventually we'll kind of do that all around the place. But it's easy to get distracted in all these little details and never really advance the game any further because there's 40 minutes, you know, and you spend your time just cleaning out what you've already worked on. Wow, they... It seems like the spiders are a bigger thing than I remember them being. I don't remember dealing with spiders this much, this often. Mm. I could accomplish a lot more when I played this before. Like they've they've become a lot more, uh, you know, common or aggressive. Anyway, I was trying. No, I wasn't. Where do we still have? Okay, he's gone. Let's get that done. Where is that? That's second page. It's still not there. Okay, somebody had it on the back, and then they got the command to go and play with spiders. So it's been dropped somewhere else again. We may never see that animal trap. <laughs> just put the trap down in there. Well, we still need to go and use all these before I can do that. So let's trust that they're going to live through the night. And let's pop a couple of glowy stars out here so we can see what's going on. And give them the order to go take out him. And then what? Traps f second, right? Cages first, so I can't really cage. I don't want cages too far away because you end up having to send them a long distance to be able to go and clear out what's in the cage. So let's just kind of randomly put things out here. It'll be fine. All right, that's all we're going to get into. What? You're pointing. What's, what's that right there? What is what? What is that thing? Uh, it looks like a piece of a bridge that has dropped. So you can put something in there. Okay, so we can cage there, you're saying. But you're not saying very loud. <laughs> Remember, you broadcast your voice. Okay. Okay. It's so easy to sit back and get comfortable in the chair and just start watching the game and forget that you're now a, a YouTube broadcaster um, in training. So, anyway, we're doing swimming lessons here and taking care of this stuff low health over here you got it no problem but you might fall off the ladder getting there right we'll do that make sure you make it to bed okay so this is done we are being really annoying over here we did get caught in the trap over there we've got a near naked sheep over here it's not ready to be caught you can still catch it. Just don't That's right, you can catch it, but no point in shearing it. And you got the command. No, you didn't. Can you just go rest? Thank you. 
Thank you. All right. But there's so many resources out here. Oh, I want those imps. That just changes the whole game when you can let somebody else go and collect all the stuff. While they're thinking about that, let's get this used up. What do we need to do? We can't. We can't do the mill without that. We can't get flour without that. All we can do really is plant seeds. Here's the magic forest. Ooh. Let's go there. So we need to put these out. We're going to skip the, the fish stew. That's now gone. Magic forest is right there. But we got to wait till daytime to use it. Get the full effect. What are you? You're the sieve. The sieve helps the miller. We don't have a miller yet. Okay. Here's the backpack. We haven't done that. Let's do the backpack real quick. The backpack takes the place of these other... Um, helpers like the sieve so those that well I'm talking and I can't uh, I can't do this so hold on all right let's make four of them because we're not going to actually use that many let's go to equip those that are not using something that will help their skill will have an empty slot for something like the backpack which Increases the number of items that the dwarf can carry. So double click that in there. And how do you pronounce this? Rally? Rely? Rally. Rally. I, I'm going with Rally. And give you a little boost of, of health there. Make sure you're the one I sent back to bed. All right, you should be fine. Otherwise, we've got a carpenter who could use a saw, logger, and carpenter. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. And we've got a miller who's eventually going to want the sieve. But for now, we'll get a backpack. We always seem to be doing this while they're in the middle of a battle, don't we? It's just the convenient time to do it. Um, carpenter, saw. We've got a miner. That's the lamp. This one? Mm-hmm. Yeah. That didn't work, did it? There we go. We've got logger, hunter, warrior. What do you see? We don't have the sharpening stone. We don't have another saw. And I'm not sure what hunter would be. So you get a backpack. And climber, logger, archer. We already have this. But that takes the place of the shield. So you can still have a backpack too. Am I getting this wrong? No, because all the other ones are down here. And yet that's the only one where the boost is up here in place of the shield. I think, I, I think it can go either way. Okay. So, what's left? Well, we don't have any backpacks left. Skaggy, you're just you're just on your own. Okay. Well, he had a float. You can give him a floater. I can I can get him floating, huh? Skaggy. He's a swimmer. Okay, swimmer. I've got a mic boom going right through the screen right there, and I can't see that path. i got to keep going sideways. Eventually, that suspension arm's going to gonna get here, and I'll redo how the mic is set up between us. Um, floater, right there. Okay, we're good. You guys have this under control, and I want all this loot brought in, so let's just max that out. You guys don't stop until you've brought me more wood and more food. And you brought all this stuff in, and then you brought more wood, and of course, a bunch more roots. <laughs> uh, we'll do that. Do them in, in blocks where they are close to each other, like these three. Okay. Is that enough for now? I wanted to replace those. I already did the back ones. And that's good enough. Sheep is there. Craft is the cage. It's still, the trap is still not there. Um, we're done here. Mm -hmm. I think we're done enough there. Let's drop this into there. And let's go play with that bridge real quick. And if you see that light up, let me know. But I want to know, this is what we came out here to do, huh? All the lights are still there. I want to know what happens. Let's see, they can shoot three. One, two, three. I think they reach. The next bow will do four spaces away, but the current bow will do three. But we'll plan for the, the bow with the four. If we do that, as well as we're gonna take out every other one and, and get these replaced finally. 
then I'm hoping the archers will run down and start shooting down below. I'll have to wait and see if that actually happens. And then, this either way, they're not going to fall off these wooden bridges. At least I don't think I've ever seen them do that. Replace front blocks. That didn't work. There we go. Um, I don't think we're hurting on leaves, so I'm not going to send them down there to do that. So what do we do next? Do some mining. Do some harvesting. Will it let me harvest one of its green? No. But why is it? Oh, the green is the, the, the slime, slime torches. Okay, so these are ready to harvest. Now, can I plant seeds in place of those? I wonder. Okay. But we have a different set of rules now. I'm going to test something. Where are those at? First one. Seeds? No. The second one. Second one. There they are. I want to test something. Let's go to there. What happens when you right click and slide? It doesn't give me the command to choose it. So I guess that's not a case. Okay, so that won't happen. So these have got to be harvested before that ground is available. That's what I wanted to verify. All right, do we go after ants or do we continue mining? What do you want to do? Do the ants. Do the ants? Well, we're in between battles. That's probably a good time to accept that, you know, they yeah. fell. Ah, uh, why don't you go to rest? Really? Like you're stunned and won't obey a single thing that I have to say here, huh? Give it a portal. Interesting. Select dwarf. Go rest. That one worked. Okay. So I guess there's a, uh, a time when they're stunned in between. In fact, let's kind of uh, do a general, everybody who needs it, go to rest. And everybody who needs it, go eat. I'll send all the... Well... Got enough heart. Yeah, so I'm going to say go rest again to those who need rest more than eat. So I'll do the, you have to do the rest command last, because the eat command seemed like it overruled the, the rest command. More food. More food. What do we want? Let's just kind of top everything off. Don't have a lot to top off. There. Some eggs. And we'll do some of these. Need more salads. I wish you could click on the stove and, and, and craft food. And it would take you to this menu. That'd be, that'd be cool. Alright, do that. And then there, there. There you are. And like so. Alright, so that's done. And there is one more fish stew, but I'd have to go find it to use it. That's still not there yet. I wish there was a way to locate where it's been dropped. And we still have all this loot. I haven't gotten to it yet. Oh, well, there it is. Where are you seeing it? Right there. Yeah. So somebody dropped it at this point. Hmm. Now they're going to collect loot based on the distance they have to walk. So this loot's all first. And eventually, when they get to here, they'll go back and go to there. Until I give them a command to go and dig. Or to, you know, take out some, some ants. Yeah, never never give them enough time just to just to relax. Now, I am I guess I can light this up. Mm -hmm. I can do that. You have to get closer, though. Boy, where? Oh! That was interesting. I was seeing water dripping, and it seemed to drop all the way down to about here. Yeah. Normally, when you find this guy, it's in a big open cavern. I don't think I've ever seen it this compact before. So, to take care of that, I was going to try to find a way to get down to where they were down here without getting into this mess. So, I was a little worried that they had somehow merged the two into one. So, light up that one down there. Light up down here? Yeah. Do we want to ruin the surprise? Yeah. We want to. I can't. Closer, right there. There. Interesting. No monsters. And kind of a path to get around in here already pre-built. Okay. So let's take care of these guys. Mine that, 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 and that. No, you want no? to avoid that dirt there. That's going to fall? Yeah. Okay. So just get it while you can. 
Just so you're saying just go straight across. Yeah. But the problem is our guys are going to keep getting knocked back into this. I want to get them down at ground level. Eh, no problem. Just put a staff scaffold. Okay. But they so they won't fall if there's a scaffold there. No, they just climb down. So I can preset a scaffold there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I can't give them the the command to attack yet. Yeah, it won't do any good because they have no access to it. No. It'll just mess them all up. So all we really have is a command to mine, and they're just going to kind of do that randomly. Should put a portal there. Unless I put a portal there. Okay. Mm -hmm. And mana's decent. Okay, do this. Do we have any quests? <clears throat> we don't. To take out ants or enemies. Okay. Didn't want to accomplish this and suddenly get 12,000 points and we're at level 12 and I didn't use all these up. Okay, get ready. Okay, now. And let's get a second portal in there. You're just right down there in the middle. There we go. Yep, they did it. And then the, the ant nest explodes. It drops off all kinds of slime. Alright, well, while we're here, and we have all that, uh, that portal sitting there unused, Ah, that's considered solid. I can't do that. Let's take all those out, those out, that one, that one, that one. I like to open up the hole behind. Oh, you do? Yeah. Okay. Just so you can see the... That way more. The other world behind there a little bit. Just a little peek, you know. Mm-hmm. Kind of fun. Louder. Mm-hmm. Louder. You're broadcasting now. Scaffold. Thank you. I'm out of scaffolds. <laughs> no, they're done with that. Other side. Yes. Yeah, but if I can get my right click and my left click figured out. Um, you do. Why are you still red? Don't do that. Do that. Okay. So there, there, there. More scaffold. There we go. And then eventually even down below. We'll let them take out this. So we've got basically two layers in front of us and then whatever's behind. It makes more sense when you're, you're thinking of what's out here as sky behind. But it the horizon kind of maintains a little bit while you're back here. So as if, as if we're mining through a very thin mountain, I guess. Well, that's kind of down below, though. That's underneath. So how do you explain that? Like we're breaking into a huge cavern that's back behind it? I guess. I guess I like to make my games make sense. Well, <laughs> when you look around in there, it looks different. I mean, doesn't it? Uh-huh. Than outside. I guess if I zoomed out. Yeah, okay. That's staying down below. Okay, so they're pretty much done there. What next? Um, got our cage. All right, let's go set this up. Wow, you zoom out, it really messes with your your uh, your your sense of where you are. All right, let's go to here this time. We'll we'll make it blatant, right on top of the sheep. Go catch a sheep, and let's get the shears or the scissors being made. Where was that? Here? There? Yep. There. Okay. Scissors. Iron ore. We're that low on iron ore. Wow. We need to do some mining. Are we going to pop this in? be nice to see it happen. But it never happens when I want it to. Okay. Iron ore. What was that? That's a book. And let's get the... Let's get the lighting... It's all iron there. Yeah, but I'm going to get the lighting fixed so we don't have to deal with spiders anymore. I'm getting tired of every time I go out here to do the next step, I have to keep repeating the same step. So no more of that. Let's get this lit up. So iron is in here. And let's take that out. 
uh, take these out and let's make about 20 more scaffolds because I want to not have to keep finding the old scaffolds and making more of them but we still have to make them so never mind we have five and I can't put them in I need them to be able to get up higher okay um, we'll get the ones that are right there that are right where yeah I wish we had two mice can you have two mice Just connected to the computer without uh, collect these right here oh I was looking for the scaffolding that you said to collect right there but you didn't say scaffolding okay um, but we can't get well I can set them but they can't get to them yet replaced rear actually I don't know if that works is there something back behind there there isn't only the one mm. okay so that one and while you're here I guess the coal but there you go rear coal coal and rear all right what yeah right there okay coal I think there's one there. Really dark. No. There's one. Okay. Take those. Take that one. Alright, so let's get into this area. And let's just step this. Back that off. Step up into here. Into there. There. Yeah, we can jump that. We can get into here. And we're still fairly deep here, so these guys aren't going to pound their way in just yet. Thank you, Trap. He walks right through it. Okay. But, Mr. Sheep, what you going to do? You're going to stop right now, aren't you? Oh, you're going for... Oh, ah! <laughs> so close! Go for the... There we go! Now, catch. And while we're waiting, any iron? Here, there, nope, not yet. Let's see if someone pops in here and bags them up. Kill him. Nope, 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 nope. Hmm. Watch there. Do what? Get to watch over there and see if someone's getting close. But they have to go to the portal to jump through it. Yeah. So, which is probably where that green dot is right there. Let's so. put a portal down below. So okay. Something else. So you're trying to. We so if we put guy. a portal here, they'll portal to there, then portal all no, the way. No, the portal straight over. You don't have to have two stops. Really? Yeah. I've always seen them go back to the to the the main one. The main one branches out every point, so they have to go to the center to go out. I'll have to test that someday. Okay, he got him. And we'll just we'll leave you out here on your own. You'll you'll be fine. More wood. Clean all that mess up and grab me some food there. And Ah. Do we have to have two to, to make more? You might. I think You think you have to have two? Yeah, I, with the sheep I had to. The chickens, I don't I think they were Check your chicken below. See what okay. Where I'm at. Well, the chickens are doing fine. So you didn't need to get yeah. another one. Um, so at least I usually keep at least two alive. Okay. Let's grab a few more fences. Which were there. I can only make two. Uh, nails. Let's get some of you in stock. And that's the end of our iron. Okay. Fences. Where'd they go? They were there. And we'll put you into that slot. Let's go check our our uh, this over here. We're still building it, okay? But I can set these in though. And eventually we get there. Who's under attack and why? All right, that's from Tree Mites. Okay. So you you leave you alone. And what's on the other side? Be nice to catch him. But I think we'll just we'll just do that for now. Other side's over here. Nothing's walked into it yet. Otherwise, what's going on over oh, here? Still in the dirt there. Ah, okay. Portal. Take you out. Build. And we're taking them out. Okay. 
cleaning all this mess up. Yeah, this might be easier with two mice. I just don't know how the game will interact with that. But it could be a second pointer to say, just go over here, and then, you know, the one mouse that's actually the game mouse would uh, would do the clicking. I have to experiment with that. I've got a few extra mice just kind of hanging around. Speaking, oops, that didn't work. Got used to that. There we go. Speaking of mice hanging around, how are we doing down here? Any rats? It feels like we've been an awfully long time without a rat invasion. There's a book. There's a book. Climber's book. Let's take the torch out and... Boy, I wish there was an easier way to, to, to fill this back in with dirt. I guess I'm just going to abandon that idea. We've got plenty of room up here. I've, I've got to do just one at a time. I can't pre-place anything but the very last one. Though I could do these. That would make me feel better. Let's fill these in. And we're just going to skip that. Okay. <clears throat> so, 35 minutes into the episode. Fences did get built. Let's extend this direction. And seed. It seems like we should have a lot more seed than that. Well, you. We planted all that. We just picked it all up, but that didn't increase. No, it makes it into wheat. And then the wheat you convert back to seed. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. so we have lots of wheat right now. All right, so I can do that, and build. Okay. So our wheat is where first, food. First one. Right there, ninety-two. Um. Okay, let's go to seed. Second one. That makes one wheat. So each seed made must have made more than one wheat. It must have made two or three. Well, to, if you need more seed, you put the wheat into right there. But it wouldn't be a one for one. Otherwise, you just constantly hello. That came up awfully quick. I wasn't watching either. Yeah. Well, we're at thirty-five minutes. Shall we go for it? Sure. Let's go for it. Well, what, what do we, while we're paused, what do we need to do before then? I mean, nobody has been sent to bed recently to rest. Yeah, check it. Um, Make sure. Okay. So, health wise, we do have some that are pretty iffy. Let's control R and send some of them to bed. Hopefully, they will have rested and be able to, to help out with the, uh, the, the second half of the battle. Otherwise, we need to send everybody home. Yeah, let's do that. Let's kill all portals once everybody's in. And they are. So do that and then turn that back off. They can continue with what they're doing. Control R to rest in case I canceled that. And we'll see if this is our first double portal, double enemy wave, or double wave, we'll say that. There's Fido 1, <laughs> Fido 2. Let's see here. Are they identical? The cats weren't. I don't know, he's brighter. Is it because he's near different light sources? They look kind of the same. So the owl cats are gray and two different colors. Here we go. These guys are fun to watch. And they surprised me how effective they were last time. So we're waiting for a smaller zombie to walk with two of them. Smaller zombie to walk by. He's giving up, he's walking back. Why is that? He only, he can only do. He's going to grab this zombie over here? No. He can only do the foot catapult. Oh, he's... Yeah. He's getting closer. There's no zombies in this list. We're only seeing skeletons and things. Oh, yeah, gargoyles too. Yeah. Am I going to regret having done this this episode? <laughs> well, I guess we're not going to get a show this time. There's nothing to throw. So let's get this taken care of. Get everybody over here. We only have two, one sleeping dwarf. So everybody else is ready. The gargoyles are beginning their attack. Kind of hard to click on them individually. There's another one. Get these guys. There should be plenty to... Where is everyone? Uh, everyone's down here. Let's give them a quicker path up. 
there and there. All right. Look at that cat attack. One and a half. Okay, there's one that's down. Let's go ahead and equip and, and uh, get her powered up again. Right there. Uh, I'll stop there. I missed one? No. Okay, we're good. And we're using our new bridge. We're not falling off. Looking good. And this guy needs to be taken out before he shoots us. Okay, he's gone. And the rest are waiting down here. Let's think about taking them out from behind. Although these guys are going in right now, so let's... Oh, there's a zombie, but he didn't get thrown. Okay, let's undo him and concentrate on these guys. Okay, equip. Who was that? That was Maya. Use. So Maya is what? I was going to say, she's got a spear. Does that make a difference? A spear or a club or something. Well, what is the... She's the one that's always going down in health. What's the number on it? 20. 20. Does it put her in a greater chance of being hit compared to one of them with a sword? I know. So because she's the one I have twice now had to add more, and none of the other ones. Hmm. So I don't know if that's a coincidence or not. Goblin Spear 20. Huh. Let's give somebody else the spear. Who's got a weapon that's a good quality one, a 20? And we'll swap them out. There's one. So we'll give him the spear, and give Maya the this one, and see if she drops in health again. Now, who is it we gave it to? Right there, Skaggy. So let's see if Skaggy suddenly has a health problem. Although, I was only looking at hers. Anybody else that's really low in health? No, we're good. Alright, so we're concentrating on this guy. So he's being... Kicks. Kicks and stomps. Who was that? Um, equip. So... Ragna. No, that was a guy, wasn't it? Mm, don't think so. Oh. Well, we'll find out. We'll go a little further. Use... Nope. Right here. Oh. Alright, took him down. Let's take out the rest of these. Who are we missing? Where are the rest of the gargoyles? They're all gone? They're gone. We can head here next. And that's it on this side. <laughs> Frozen in time. Oh, they did their little dance. Oh, they did? Yeah. There they are. <laughs> one of them. Yeah. Well, we got to see one dancing. Otherwise, we're going to take care of these guys. And we've made it through another wave. So, up to 11 levels, 11 dwarves, we are still a single enemy wave coming at us. Let's see what 12 does, which is probably going to be next episode. Alright, so, this has been Noble Rambler. Thanks guys for watching, and... Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>